Hey, this is John Fix a Fence, 503-935-2331. I've been getting some uh, comments on YouTube uh, from you guys about uh, doing some tension wire. So this video is about tension wire and I'd like to thank you for your comments and concerns about uh, getting this stuff up in a proper position. It is important for the customers because they are what put food on our table. So anyway, it's probably what you're going to need here. A pair of gloves maybe. <clears throat> These are called brace bands. Okay, you'll see that what we're going to need. Uh, also the brace band, uh, this uh, ratchet, you know. Oh, look at the turf bird there. This is the business card holder and I've been telling you about that one. There's another one of these turf birds here. Haha, -ha, cow duty. <clears throat> Here's the uh, uh, come along. You're probably going to need that. Uh, pull jack. <clears throat> Bolt cutters. You need that to cut the tension wire with. And uh, this is what's called the hog ring pliers. Okay, and here's uh, some of these hog rings here. Okay, and then uh, this is the uh, T bar. Okay, and I'll show you how to use that. And then, uh, of course, I did tell you in the last turf bird video that uh, we got the uh, uh, the deluxe model. And uh, this is the one that I did send to the president, and he sent me a thank you note. So. Okay, anyway, I was telling you guys, you probably need a pair of flyers. Okay, don't forget that. But anyway, this is how you do the loop on the uh, tension wire. This is 9 gauge smooth wire. Go ahead and put yourself a little wrap in it like that. I don't know if you can see that. And then that's why your pliers are so handy. You want to take your pliers, grab onto it, put your thumb up against it, kind of come around, follow it around, make a nice little wrap. Okay, and then you can cut the thing off like that. And then I'll show you where it goes, okay? Now remember the brace band that I was telling you about <clears throat> over there on the end of the truck with the turf birds. Uh, here's a nut and bolt. Now what we're going to do is we're going to take this off and we're going to set this in here. Okay, so uh, uh, I'll show you what it looks like when I'm done. Okay, so once you have it in place and you got your uh, your loop inside the brace band with the nut and bolt, go ahead and tighten it up and put it into place. And then I'll show you what it looks like when we get it tightened up on the other end, okay? Okay, so <clears throat> make sure you, you put the tension wire on the outside of the fabric here in between the line posts and the chain link okay and then you can cut off the, your excess or however much you want but bring it on down here measure it up get yourself a little bit of measurement there you want to cut this off with that okay and then you can either come up or down I kind of like to go up through and then what you want to do is you want to get your t-bar here Set it through there, okay? And then what you want to do is you want to twist up and away from, okay? And tighten, just just give it a good yanking, okay? And that ought to be good. And then take this off. You want to keep your tension on there. Maybe just kind of use your T-bar to bring it around, okay? And you could always either cut it off like that, take your pliers and, uh, give it a good wrap like that too so uh, there's plenty of ways to do it <clears throat> you know as long I guess the main thing is as long as you get the job done in the time that you've allowed uh, the job to take so anyway fix the fence 503-935-2331 showing you how to do tension wire here in Portland Oregon